How are we doing today? My name's Preston Johnson, and this is an Adobe Audition tutorial on how to create karaoke tracks out of music that you already own. So this is going to save you money because you won't have to buy individual karaoke tracks. So whether you're a professional DJ, a weekend warrior, or you just want to practice singing your favorite songs, this video is perfect for you. All right, so the first step is to import your song and then bring it over to your multi-track view. I'm using a song by my man Sam Adams. It's called I Hate College. And Sam Adams is a rapper from Boston. There was a there was a time where he sold more than DJ Khaled and Lil Wayne on iTunes. And so he kind of blew up overnight. He's got some really cool music. Anyways, you're going to want to zoom in on your track and find out where the vocals start. So let's listen to it. I hate college remix. All right, so the vocals start right about here. Once you're there, it's pretty easy. All you do is click Effects, Filters, Center Channel Extractor, Add. From there, you're going to click Properties, and this opens up your Center Channel Extractor. In here, there's a couple things you can do. If you slide the Center Channel level all the way to the right, let's listen and see what happens. I hate college remix. I hate college beloved. All right, so basically what you have is an acapella is an acapella song. You have all words, all all vocals and no music or, you know, little to no music. If you move it all the way to the left, it does the opposite effect. So here you have the music without any vocals. Now, when you move the center channel all the way to the left, it it makes it a little bit distorted. So what you're going to do is find somewhere in the middle that sounds right. So what I like to do is just go up here to my presets, click karaoke. It drops the center channel level to negative 20 decibels. So let's listen to that one more time. All right, so it sounds pretty good. It's got it's got minimal vocals and it's got the most amount of music without without any without much of that distortion. So once you're done there, you're going to click X. You're going to click OK to apply the setting and then you're done. Simple as that. So once you do that, it applies that effect to the whole track. Let's listen to the whole thing. And there you have it. Now you know how to create your own karaoke tracks and it only takes a few minutes. Please subscribe and leave comments on whatever things you'd like to learn about Adobe Audition. Thanks for listening.